Dragon Ball Super Superhero is the newest film in the Dragon Ball franchise to hit theaters. And it's the first Dragon Ball movie I've ever seen. And I've only watched about 15 episodes of the show. This will be a great review for you. Here's the deal, the only reason I went to this movie is because I have a 10 year old son who's really into Dragon Ball right now. I suggested he watch it because he was a big fan of Naruto, or Naruto, I don't know how to say the name, I've never seen the show, heard that one's good too. Uh, and I said, hey, listen, I caught random episodes of Dragon Ball Z on Adult Swim back in the day, Toonami, I believe it was called. I'm young, I'm in touch. And I really liked what I saw, but I was never able to like sit through chronologically and enjoy the show from beginning to end. Anyway, I watched like 15 episodes of Dragon Ball Super in order. And man, I have to tell you that show was pretty fun. And then I found out there was like 100 and some episodes more. And I was like, there's not enough hours in the day for me right now. Then I saw there was a Dragon Ball Super superhero movie coming out. And I said, all right, I'm taking my son. I'm gonna surprise him. And I did, we got into the theater without him even knowing what we were going to. He loved it, and I'm happy to say, it was a good freaking time. And I will say, well, what's that Piccolo? Oh, uh, pissed off Piccolo's off screen. Why are you so mad? Because they haven't subscribed to the channel? Yeah, he's right. You should subscribe to Adam Does Movies if you haven't. I post tons of movie reviews, TV show content, rants, reactions, all sorts of stuff here each week. I'd love to have you, and <laughs> he would too. As I was saying, should you watch this movie with very little knowledge outside the fact that these characters are now skins you can use in Fortnite? No. I would absolutely get your hands on some of the episodes at least. Familiarize yourself with the main cast. I watch the English dub version as I've watched the show because I'm a basic bitch and also I have a younger son who's not gonna read that stuff. He's not gonna read if he has anything to say about it. Uh, English dub was great. Like I said, I'm a basic Dragon Ball fan now, so I don't really know what the whole thing has to offer, but what I saw in this movie, pretty damn sweet. Characters flying everywhere, <laughs> throwing punches, dodging in slow motion, reading their opponent, Kamehameha! Doing the badass fireball moves. I mean, I thought it was great. <laughs> I don't know how long I can keep this up for. Try this out for size. <laughs> Impressive. You'll never see this coming though. I'm powering up. It also helped that I really dug the animation style. Now this is probably one of those things in the community that's a turnoff for some or it's a hot button issue. I don't know. I don't know what the community's like. To my knowledge, this is the first movie to go full on 3D. I mean, it's 3D, but it almost looks 2D at the same time. It's a hybrid of sorts. When I watched Dragon Ball, I always thought the tone was done very well. Obviously, it's very light, it's fun, it's a comedy action, but there's a lot of drama too. And they do a good job of not undercutting the drama very often. There is some jokes and some silly characters thrown in uh, during some of the shots. But for the most part, it does a great job of keeping them separate yet connected. And I will say this was a funny movie. I was chuckling a few times at some of the jokes. I'm sure if you're a fan of this franchise, there's some stuff there that went way over my head, but you'll probably catch. If you saw the trailers, you'll notice there's not a lot of Goku in this. This is a very specific Piccolo Gohan film. It's focused on their story. And Goku and Vegeta definitely take a back seat in this. I will say, stay for the credits. And so to quickly summarize, Fantastic fighting, beautiful animation, some fun character moments and jokes throughout, and from what I can gather, a good celebration of all things Dragon Ball. All right, now I'd like to hear from you. What did you think of the film if you saw it? Are you a huge Dragon Ball fan with a lot to say? Put it down below. Like the video if you had a good time. Yep, yep, Piccolo saying hit that subscribe button. <laughs> okay, I'm watching you. Uh, and I'll see you next time. Thanks again for watching. Since you made it this far, maybe think about joining me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash Adam Olinger, where I'm playing Fortnite currently. That's right, I got those Dragon Ball skins. Actually, I don't. I'm too cheap to pony up, but uh, I have been enjoying getting shot by Goku about 5,000 times. I'm also on TikTok at Adam Does Movies, and you can become a Patreon at patreon.com slash Adam Does Movies. Say, Adam, I really like what you're doing. Here's a dollar a month, five dollars. Keep it up, and I will, I will.